Tekken 6, we had Tekken 6. Tekken 7, we have the top six. Now, we're down to top four. I'm here with the boy, Rip. It's your guy, Tasty Steve. We're in Mandalay Bay with an amazing crowd to watch how this is about to unfold. Thank you guys so much for joining us. I can't wait to get back to these Tekken matches, bro. Exactly. Top four incoming here, guys. Our next match, of course, going to be USA versus Korea. Genghis Don going up against Ulsan. And once again, I have to reiterate just how good Olsan is. Took a small hiatus from Tekken. Yes. Tekken, but when he came back, still just as dominant and still just as strong, which is crazy enough. No matter where he went, was able to get some of these top placements, like I said before. Genghis Don, first time up here on the stage, but definitely a player known in the USA, especially on the online side of things. You talked about how he took a little break, but now he's back again, and look at what that has done for him. Look at what his gameplay has evolved to, to be on this stage in the top four. I mean, I feel like I first really got to know Genghis Don when we started talking about the EU versus NA rivalry, right? Yes. Because Genghis Don had that crazy run, I think it was CEO 2021, maybe, in December, so. where he took out a couple of the EU top players, and we're like, oh man, Genghis Don, everyone started memeing with him, posting his images everywhere of him yelling, ah, right? And so now, he's got to this point where we haven't seen him in as many events, really, but now that he's here, and EU's not in the top six, Genghis Don is the one still standing strong here in the top four, even. Mm -hmm. And the first battle, the RPS goes to Osan. I like that that's become a part of the, the meta, right? I feel like that's the first battle. Like, yo, who wins yeah, RPS? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think yesterday when I was playing my match, I played an RPS, so when they beat me, I was like, well, now I know how you play. Right. You know? <laughs> I see. You're a rock guy. Got it. Exactly. Look at Ulsan. He, he's getting in people's heads, right? He's wearing that Fang main since 2022, never using Fang in his top six. It's all Bob all the way so far, unless he switches it up here, Steve. You know, I wouldn't be surprised, but also, he still has that Kazumi, right? Yeah. And Kazumi, another character. I talked to him about this when he first came back. I'm like, bro, we don't see many Kazumis. How do you feel about the character? I know right. they made some changes to her wall damage a little different. He was like, dude, I still think this character is really strong, but I also feel like she is a little bit more reserved. We already talked about Katarina over the seasons of Tekken 7. Literally got better and better and better. And I feel like Genghis Don is really putting this on display. Much like this amazing EVO 2023 trophy. Oh my gosh. To it have that beautiful. in your house. Think yeah. about that. You get to walk in and the sunlight hits that bad boy, blinds you, and you're like, yeah, I'm a champ. I mean, think about it. The Evo trophy hasn't changed forever, right? Yeah. I mean, I remember that trophy back in like 2009, 2010-ish. So it's been over a decade since they've updated the trophy. And mm. so that's the first major update to what the trophy looks like, which is sick. Well, we're going to get a champion, potentially a new champion here for Evo. But not if Arslan Ash has anything to say about it. Waiting in that grand finals, but there's a few more battles left. There's a few more oh, battles yeah. left. Who's going to get to fight Al? Who's about to go home right now? And now I have a question. If you guys would like Osan to take the set, make some noise! Oh, man. Wow. Oh, man. I like your allegiance, though. I like that. I like that. Rip, ask them the other question. The other question. Well, hey, if you guys would like the USA's Genghis Don to take it, make some noise! Hey. Hey, my man in the red hoodie screaming like crazy. I see you, my guy. I see you, my guy. Here we go. Genghis Don versus Ulsan. And the thing that's wild about this one, Ulsan's teammate from KDF, Moyo, just taken out by Genghis Don. Ulsan also plays in those Afrika Tech and League tournaments where he has Galgongi as a training partner, essentially for Katarina, and that didn't help Moyo. Let's see how he does here against Genghis Don's Katarina. Here we go, here we go, here we go to stay alive in this top six for Tekken 7. The next battle is about to start. Let's go. And the characters are going to be Katarina versus Bob from Olsan. And we're going back to the poolside stage, Steve. What a banger of a song. Got Lee in the background hanging out. You love this part, right, Rip? Yeah. <laughs> Let the show begin. Talk to him, Bob. Let the show begin. Here we go. Wave was coming in. They dance just a little bit right now. Just lower start. Expected here. Oh, nice interrupt with the down 4 1. Good nice duck in the hug. Oh, now. Oh, yeah. And Olsan's punches against Katarina have been really good so far. This is going to make Genghis Don slow down and change things up a little bit. Finishes the string. Great punish. Yeah, there's a lot of testing going on. Sidestep. 
stuck and the launch for the Harrier this time. Uh, uh, uh. And the finish, yes sir. Ulsan first round. And we've talked about it, right? Size the bright duck to beat the Harrier options, but no one's really taken advantage and punished big for it. And that was the first time we saw it. So that's a great right. option too, yeah. That's right, you said it. Yeah, and the attack on top of it though, right? Just to at least punish her once you get that side step. Really fast mid, really strong. Mm -hmm. That one right there is gonna be a big game changer in this matchup. Oof. The strings. Crouch dash one. Oh, Power wow. crush! Oh. Yo, caddy corner combos? No. Not quite. Man. Harry trying low. to get out of that corner. Countering knee though! Oh, this is a dicey one. The sidewall. Sidewall. Life preserver Steve. Doesn't matter. The low kick goes out. Gangazan ties up the round count. Keep it close. Keep it close. God, this is such a good song. Harry or low. Caught swinging in the mist there. Old sign. Answers back with a down 4 1. While standing 4, really gonna stop some of those Harrier dash in options, especially if you do it early. Yeah, Gangsan got caught moving a bit there, but wasn't hit the button, so no counters. That works out for him. Mid after the roll. Oh, caught him big time! Big counter hit. This is gonna put him no! in range if the combo is correct, but there it is, that extra hit. You gotta be careful. Get Mixing the it up! Black thing is done. Two rounds to one versus Olsan. Yo, Gang is done right now, though. Uh, what a run. Uh, not over just uh, yet. Harrier low. And nothing. Yeah, Olsan starting to freeze up. He's not reacting to Harrier. Look at this. Caught the traffic to prevent the side step. That might be enough. Barrier break for the balcony. He missed the combo. Oh, no. Olsan with rage here. Can he make a crazy comeback? Oh, I don't think my so. God. Gang is done. You're putting me to sleep. Oh my goodness, what a crazy scramble at the end there. But Genghis Khan, in those scramble situations, has been making the right decisions, and that's what matters. This year is a first to two situation. Ooh. Genghis Khan just needs one more game to move into top three. Ulsan's in trouble. Will he stick with the Bob here, Steve? It looks like he's at the state select. Seems like he's gonna commit. I talked about the fact that I feel like Kazumi definitely does a great job here, right? Does a great job here. Her down 4 1 as well. We're not seeing the switch, oh. it doesn't look like. But Osan definitely has characters with tools that can kind of counter this movement that Harry was saying. Some of the options that we see Katarina go for. But jungle outpost to a breakable balcony, a breakable wall. This is good for Katarina, but also Bob can get a lot of damage in these situations. I think if your gang is done, you like the stage pick. Yeah. The, the breakable balcony, another wall on top of that. On top of that, he actually has been getting old sign by finishing strings. We saw the early yeah. wall splat to finish on the down 4 1 2. I like the way he's playing right now. I think old sign just didn't expect him to finish that string there, right? So he's being tested in ways. And they were testing each other in that first game, but let's see what happens here. Game number two. Gang is not in the lead versus old sign. Round one. Fight. Oh, Blade Crouch wall. low. Nice option there to challenge that. Yeah, great ground and hit damage from Katarina. And look at this sidewalk in the back. That back two string, big damage. Hell sweet. First time we've seen that. Uh huh. And the wall splat, re wall splat, big damage. Not dead. Oh, Hell it dead. Welcome to Bob. Yo, Wave will, wave will give you one to grow on after the round. Good break. Nice string. Wow, what, what a, a sidestep on the left. Yo, the first option. <laughs> Uh, Usually that doesn't hit opponents that are crouching, but in that stage, just barely clipped up. And Olsan taking control here on this stage. Man, that back two string is doing work. Look at the sidewalk again. The hot kick punches there. Back to the wall we go. Tons of damage. Hella damage. Look at the life. And Olsan running away quick with this one. Yo, game two looking all Olsan right now. Nice Harrier transition going for the low. Really starting to tap the digital ankles. Oh, I said the digital ankles. Oh, don't dunk though. The digital ankles. The wall saved but I don't think so. What those digital ankles, the perfect. The last, and I'll give you one to grow on too. Gang is done. Bringing the crowd back to life here. Goes for the 1-1 one, one string. I can hear the, I can hear uh -huh. the, I can hear the crowd. I can hear Mandalay Bay counter hit. Balcony break? Balcony. You know it. That's one balcony. Let me take this wall. Holy uh, moly, the carry! Uh, big damage. Huge damage. Big Don't step. All right. Uh oh, uh oh. Be careful. Osan trying to close out the game and tie it up here. 
Oh, oh. That could have been big. Hop kick gets stuck. Probably oh. better. Rage mode gang is on. Yo, hit him with the elbow drop. I want to see it. It just looks cool. Why would you tell him that, Steve? The no. elbow. Oh. Not going to happen. Old on. Gets the loss on the big risky low there. And now we are tied up. One game each. My man Bob just jumps back up to the top of the stage. One on. game of peace. This is a best of three scenario. So somebody after this match will be going home. Yeah, those lows are risky against Bob. He does have a fast launcher from crouching. So you gotta be careful here. Jackie Chan back with the coaching here, gang is done. Tournament life on the line for both players here. Who's gonna move into the top three? One game will decide, and we're going to the arena stage. This is the stage gang is done. It's picked time and time again. And Steve, it's time. Who's moving on? We're about to find out right now. Yo, crowd, you still like Genghis Don to take it, make some noise out there. Last game potential to make it to this loser's final. Damn Listen to that roar. Here we go. The arena in the arena. Hey. Round one. All right, here we go. Drop it on him. Yeah, I love, that option. I love that option. Not everybody has like instant answers to get great damage in that situation. So mm -hmm. Katarina really excels there. Lots of big damage hitting lows. Yeah, they're both kind of bad matches for each other in that way. Oh. Crowd dash one though from Olson. Back two two. Uh big damage right there. One throw, get off. Going to the mid after the roll. Big low out of the area. Wow, goes for the mid this time. Olsan at the ready, going for the duck. Doesn't duck that one, though. Life bar is very close here. Rage uh. mode for Olsan. Gangstan has one chance here. Look at oh. the sidewalk, not enough. Got him anyway. Gang is done. Gang is done. Oh, man, Olsan, he took the jacket off the stick. He's like, I'll let you see it. Let's go. I don't even care if you, you see it. You want to see it? I don't care. You want to see it? Shout out to my boy, Yipe. You want to see it? Great patient play right here. Gang is dying, not Oh, nice. Nothing big, but the punish is there. Oh. Duck the high. Gang is not reaching a little bit that time. Olsan should get the wall after this carry. Big there damage. it is. Big damage. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. That is huge damage. Wave move pressure from Olsan here. Power crush. Belly's good. 50-50 to close it out. And there we go. Olsan ties it up. One round apiece. Wow. Can you want to see what was under the cover, Steve? Now you know. These inputs, baby. This low carry, baby. Mm -hmm. That's what's there. Uh, uh, uh. Let me get the wall. Big damage once again. Smaller conversion, but still very good damage for Bob. Oof. Beautiful. 4-4-2. Four, four, Full stop starting to run away. Punish that. That power comes very good, but unsafe. Chipping away. Chipping away with the jab. The jab keeper. Race is good with the hop kick. Punch the gang is done. Wow, what a whip punish. I'll you aren't see the knee? The blue stuff? Let me see. Oh, Here God. it is. Oh, oh, look at the damage. Hella damage. He punished it, though. That's risky against Bobby. He's got such good jab range. And it's set point for Olson. Gang is done on his last leg right now, y'all. Oh, my Scoop. God. No conversion. No conversion. Didn't the low parry, though. Low parry. Olsan's looking good. Trying to get to this wall here. The uh, cop uh, conversion. Uh, Yo, crowd, Gang is not going to need your help right now. Gang is done in trouble. Nice punish here. Wait a minute. This could be the start. This could be the start. It's close. It's close. Oh. Doesn't have rages yet, though. Oh. We got a side punish. We got a side punish. It's not enough. Rage mode for Olsan. Got to watch the rage of punish. Oh, my God. The rage mark is going to kill him. Olsan takes with the last second rage hard using the armor speed and weight is gonna give Olsan the set yo crowd do me a favor do me a favor you're living in the USA make some noise for gang is done first time at EVO first time for the first time and get the top his first one finish. he just got here yo gang is done the legend they'll write stories about you Oh my goodness, what a crazy set there. But Olsan gonna be the one moving on in this bracket.
And once again, this is exactly what I was talking about. A lot of people see Osan in these situations. They're like, what is he going to do? His clutch factor is so good. The way he solidifies his gameplay, and there's the pop-off. That the rage dunk. art. Oh, my gosh. The clutch rage art there, right? Like, waiting for those hair transitions. Obviously, he had the sidesteps very early in the set. And at that time, he was like, wait a second. I have rage right now. If you do that hair transition, that jumping low, I'm ready. I'm going to hit this button. It's going to cash through with the armor. Boom. Damage. Man, I honestly, look, I love seeing those reactions because we saw how Genghis Don was really taking advantage of the Harrier transition. He's like, look, Harrier mid, Harrier low. And he was really going to a lot. And it was working. And then you start to see it add up. Crouching jab sometimes, just backing up. Like, you know what? I'm not going to even engage. I'm going to go for these whiff punishes. So you started to see the launchers a little more from Osan. And that's what got the launchers coming from Genghis Don. More consolidation. He's like, you know what? I'm not going to give you anything. Osan clutches it out once again. One of the best to do it, man. He's so good. Yeah, and this was such a fun set here. But Osan with this bob the whole way through. What a surprise it's been to see this. But Genghis Donny was turning things around in this game. Osan answered back, tied it up, one apiece. And this was, you know, we had this sidewall situation. This was the thing that kind of kills him, right? Yeah. Because it's a little risky here. Just a little bit. It's all you needed. And this is exactly I don't what think I was talking so. about. Tries to go for that Harrier transition. He's been using it every game they've played so far. And what a call out. Yeah, and the health you see that he survived with there is actually damage scaling to happen when you absorb damage from a Rage 